And one guy who knows a thing or two about Super Bowls, former wide receiver Andre Reid, who was inducted into the Pro Football Hall of Fame in 2014. He's a seven-time Pro Bowler, four-time AFC champion, and the Bills' all-time leader in receptions, receiving yards, and receiving touchdowns. Now, Reed is one of the many special guests you're going to see out there on Radio Row doing interviews. Let's take a look now, a live shot. This is what we're going to look at, look at folks. Andre Reed standing by, getting ready here on CBS Sports HQ. And thanks to the portal, we are welcoming in Andre Reed now virtually. Thank you so much for the time. We're so excited to have you here. And you're here thanks to the NFL Alumni Health Organization. Tell us more about that partnership. Yes, you know, as, uh, as part of the NFL alumni, I'm uh, you know, very aware of what's been going on. We've all been very aware of what's, what's been going on the last two years with COVID. And, uh, you know, I just want to tell people uh, that, uh, you know, the NFL alumni has done a great job of not only doing things over the past two years. There's 80-plus uh, NFL players that are a part of this campaign of uh, making sure that people, if you have questions about, you know, getting vaccinated, that you go to your doctor, you go to your healthcare professional, you go to and, and find out and get to, if you have any concerns and, and you get all the questions answered that you can. So, uh, you know, I'm glad to be a part of the NFL alumni uh, doing this. And, you know, we're all about being safe and, and go get vaccinated. Um, not only are you, you're safe, your friends, your family, um, everybody around you, uh, the community, they're all safe. And, and you say it's important. And that's what the NFL alumni is about, is about sending a message that it is important to get vaccinated. And again, anytime you had a question about it, go find the right person and get the answers that you need. Definitely a good cause. Let's talk a little football, shall we? I want to get your thoughts. Rams, Bengals, what excites you most about this matchup? Well, it's a Super Bowl, and it's two big offenses going against each other. I mean, uh, they can score points, both of them, but obviously, to me, to a certain point, um, Super Bowls are all won on defense. Uh, I played in four of them. We didn't play well on defense, but maybe one of them, and, and we, I, we lost. So uh, it's going to be up to the Bengals' offensive line to try to handle you know, Aaron Donald and, and uh, Von Miller and all of what they do on defense. And then on the other side of the ball, you know, it's, it's, uh, it's going to be the same. And turnovers are always key into games like this, especially Super Bowls, because uh, it's such a big game. And, and guys, these teams are here for a reason. They capitalize on each other's mistakes if there is mistakes. And I'm looking forward to seeing a good game. I really like the quarterbacks. You know, Joe Burrow's had a great season. He's had a great postseason. You know, Matthew Stafford has had a great season, a great po postseason. So it should be pretty good. I see the, the Rams, because they're a home team, this is the second year in a row, that a home team is going to be playing in their home stadium and for the Super Bowl. Um, I see the Rams winning 28-24 um, and Matthew Stafford being in the MVP. Don't quote me, yeah. but I just think that's <laughs> well, going Well, this is on tape, so we're going to keep this one. I want to get your thought. Who do you think, which wide receiver core do you think? Oh, you're going to keep it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, we're going to keep it. Has the edge in this matchup. Which wide receiver core? Well, I'm all about veteran guys. I mean, you know, with Odell and Cooper Cup and – Van Jefferson and, and you can't you they're going to get it done whatever they can um, obviously they're going to you know try to key on Cooper and that opens up stuff for Odell which he has done this postseason and Van Jefferson um, and then on the other side you got the young boys you know Jamar Chase perhaps maybe one of the greatest uh, you know rookie seasons of all time in, in, in NFL history there as a rookie and Tyler Boyd has done some great things and T Higgins has done some great things too so these guys can put it, you know, can put it up, put it down. They can score points. You know, they can get in the end zone. Uh, again, it'll be up to quarter to the quarterbacks to get them the ball in the situations they can, and uh, make the right make the right moves. All right. Well, we have you for a couple more minutes. I want to get your thoughts. Your Bills so close getting to the Super Bowl. One of the best games I've ever watched. That one. I mean, what did you think of that Bills Chiefs AFC Championship? Mm -hmm. Well, I thought that uh, we were going to win for sure. I think if we would have had the ball last, uh, there's no doubt we would have went down and scored. Obviously, the overtime rule has been talked about the last, you know, three weeks since this game. And, you know, who knows if they're going to change that or not. You know, that's, that's neither here nor there. Uh, we had our chances that we played a good game. Um, 13 seconds is a long time, but it just goes to show you that, you know, the next week, Kansas City lost in 13 seconds. So... Mm -hmm. 
this is a game of, uh, you know, making your own. You, you try to limit the mistakes, and then when it's out there for you to make the, make the big play, uh, that's when you got to capitalize on it. All right. Well, Andre Reed, we appreciate the time. Enjoy the rest of your Super Bowl week. Thank you so much. Yeah, but before I go, I want to uh, give, every, uh, give you a present and I uh, hope you enjoy it. So here it is. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. Andre Reid there. Do you want a sports network that delivers everything that matters about the game? The highlights, the picks, the instant analysis. No yelling, no fake debates, no politics. Hit the subscribe button and never miss a moment.